Welcome back everybody. This is a fictionalhead.com super quick tutorial. This is used uh, primarily when taking a design from Photoshop and bringing it over to HTML and CSS. Uh, a lot of times you'll have a graphic in your design that you want to get out of here and export uh, as, its, as itself for use in the web page as an element to slip in a div or whatever. Um, and if you wanted to get, like, say, this box out of here, you could get in there with your crop tool, you know, and if you have snap turned on, it'll snap to the sides, and you can crop it out and then turn off the background and all that and save it off. Um, but a quicker way to do this is to actually just, uh, if you have, especially if you have auto select turned on here to layer, just click the thing you need, uh, right click it in your layer palette, and convert it to a smart object, and it'll get this little smart object icon then you just double click it and you've automatically got a new file on transparency cropped exactly to the bounds of whatever that object was. Uh, in this instance that wouldn't be particularly hard to crop on its own. Um, and you can actually just undo once you're done and it'll go back to normal. But for a graphic like say this shadow here, I can't quite tell where it ends and I don't want to crop off a piece of it on accident and uh, have a little bit of a clipping showing when I export the graphic. So what you can do there is the same thing. Convert it to smart object, double click it, and now I've got a graphic cut right to the edges of that shadow which I can't even really tell when I'm zoomed in but I know for sure that it is uh, because the smart object clips right to the bounds of whatever the layer is then you can save that off however you want. Uh, this is also useful if, say, in this layer I've got some data way off in the side that I don't know about. When I convert it to a smart object and open it, it'll actually include all the data from that layer. So this is a good way if you're um, erasing around something and you think you've got it all but you're not certain, a quick way to check is to just convert it to smart object, double click it, or click uh, control click the layer and it'll highlight the little piece of it. Um, so that's a super handy way to just quickly clip objects out of your design so that you can export them for HTML CSS uh, cutups. Um, if you have any questions, I'm not quite sure why you would, but if you do, shoot them to me on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, whatever you want. Links are in the uh, underbar or whatever it's called. I uh, hope it was helpful.